You guys just got absolutely destroyed. Oh my god. Hello ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? It is your host, the one and only one Henderson. Today guys, I'm bringing you the next episode of Naked Gun Class Setup here today. Playing some TDM on the map Horizon using the IMR, a three burst assault rifle. Definitely not something that Hennis would use uh, on his own free will. But I've seen a ton of people using this. Definitely, I think, is the most powerful uh, three burst weapon in this game. So I figure, you know, hey, why not give it a shot? We'll see how it works for me because it apparently works very well for a few other people. Not able to pick off a kill there, but I think there was a guy down here over near the B objective. If there was a B objective here. Not seeing anybody. Oh, there's three guys right here. We pick the other one off. Oh, no, we weren't able to jump up in there. So I think it's right in here. Or did he swoop around? Maybe he heard me. Oh, here he is. Nice, guys. Able to pick him off. I like it. I like it. Quickly going 2-0 and here uh, for the first uh, couple kills in this game. Not able to get first blood like the Mark of J, but that's all right. Oh, come on. You'll pick this guy off. Nice. That guy maybe was AFK. Who knows? Oh, shoot. Not able to pick out that guy. I'm really not used to these three burst assault rifles, so I really got to get fast with my aim. Because aim is going to be so huge in this uh, with using three burst assault rifles because you can't like pre-aim or anything like that, or just start pre-firing, I mean. I mean, you could obviously pre-fire, but it just makes it a little bit more difficult. Uh, shoot. Oh, not able to pick that guy out. Got two guys coming in from two different directions. All right, let's get back up on this roof here, because this roof is always, oh my goodness, if I can jump, this roof is always a very good vantage point to get on top of uh, in order to get a good view of what's going on here. Nice. Can we pick this guy off, please? Have to do the hip fire, have to resort to the newbie hip fire. That SN6 is going to be a fun gun to use eventually once we get that. I know that is a really uh, decent weapon. Kind of underrated if you ask me. I've seen some other people using it. Not really able to get a good vantage point off here. Oh, able to only get a 50% assist on that, dude. I think people are going to start challenging me because I see them inside there. So let's, uh, let's be smart about pushing in here when we've decided to do that. Oh, God. This is bad. This is bad. Nice. Able to pick him off. Oh, no. What? No way, man. How are we not able to punch that guy? Come on, dude. We were just so close to him. Just might as well give us the punch connection. I mean, come on, internet. Honestly. Whatever. At least we're in the lead by just one kill, so that's good. At least we're winning, right? At least we're winning. So, is there a guy right here? Someone did just throw a nade, so I'm curious if someone actually is right there. Oh, did he come up on the roof behind? Oh, he came up from behind us. Dang it, man. So, the spawns did flip. Which is going to make things a little bit more difficult. Let's actually push down through here. We've got an AR, so we might actually be able to get a good vantage point of anyone here over here who's on the roof. Oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. No, man. Nah, not able to pick off that kill. We, once we get uh, better with these three burst assault rifles, guys, hopefully we'll be able to pull off better gameplays with them. And I think it'll just make me a better player in general. This guy's definitely going to get me. Yep, not able to pick him off. Tried to follow him, but uh, just couldn't get him. He was able to keep his shots on. Let's uh, see if we can get this dude. Nice. Able to pick that guy off. I think that other guy still... Was there a dude above me with a sniper? Oh, come on, man. What are the odds, dude? What are the odds, honestly? All right. So let's jump over here. Actually, the odds are pretty good. Now that I think about it, snipers usually really do like to hang out in there. Let's take a peek. Arena over here. What? Did that dude even see me? How did that dude even see me, man? Oh, that's just bad timing right there. He saw me cross over and then just started pre-firing me. Let's get back up on this roof. I know it's kind of a, a lame, campy spot to be, but to be honest with you, you know, once we start getting the feel of how this burst works anyways, we should actually probably be able to pull off better gameplays with it, like I've said before. So I think this dude's going to be pushing out here, I think is where he was thinking. I think that comes out right over there. I don't want to push it, though, just because this is kind of a, a good spot to be for right now. Not seeing anyone up in there. All right, so where are the spawns right now? Are the spawns over here? Not finding anybody. I'm scared to push in, to be honest with you. Ah, uh, nice. Able to pick off that kill on that dude over there. Nice. All right, so still only three kills behind. We may actually have to start trying to go in a little bit here and see if we can uh, pick off anything good. Nice. Sweet double kill right there. I'll take it. Good work there from Hennis. Quickly going positive here. 10 and 9. Nothing too, too, too special. But hey, you know what? At least it's a positive KD, so I'll take it. Uh, there are a ton of guys crossing over there. I don't want to just take away my position here too badly. Nice. Be able to pick out that guy. Can we pick out this guy? Oh, man. We just need a one more burst in that dude. Just one more burst in that guy, and then we would have had him. All right. Let's push back here through mid because I know a like, ton of my friendlies are going to be here now as well. Of course, the enemy's flanking us. This is a really close TDM, guys. This TDM is really coming down to the wire. If we were actually using a weapon we were more comfortable with, I think this would be more of a blowout, uh, considering the rest of my teammates aren't really pulling uh, too heavy of kills either. 
Um, alright, I really don't like crossing through here just because this really is a scary part of the map. Bam! Bada bing bada boom! Picking off that nice punch right there. I like it. Oh god, I thought that was another one. Where is this guy? Oh, there he is up there. Nice teammate. Able to pick him off. Oh shoot, man. The guy from behind us. We're quickly stuck. Hey, teammate's able to pick up the kill. Oh, now we're still tied 63. Nice. Able to pick that guy off. I think there is a dude over here. If we pay more attention to our mini map, we may actually be able to pick off smarter kills here. I'm not going to challenge that. Uh, for right now, at least. Maybe now that we've gained a little bit of our health back and there's a bit of a distraction with another teammate. Maybe. Possibly. We've got that threat detection up, so that's actually going to be really helpful as well. Hopefully that'll just give us a better viewpoint here. Oh, snoot. No, man. That shotgun dude was not able to pick off the connection for those kills. Oh, my goodness. Ah, I thought there might be a guy chasing us. Ah, nice. Able to pick him off. Can we pick off the next guy? Yes, we can. Just one more kill, team. Just one more kill. Just one more kill. Nice. Able to pick out the final kill there. 75 and 70. Coming in clutch with the final kill right there. That was absolutely awesome on our part. 18 and 12. Went on a little bit of a killing spree there at the end. Hopefully once we uh, get a better feel for this weapon, hopefully we'll be able to pull off better gameplays for you guys. But anyways, hope you guys did enjoy nonetheless. Really clutch, really fun gameplay to watch. If you guys did enjoy, please be sure to smack that like button. I really would appreciate it. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Check out all the social media links in the description below. And until next time, guys, keep gaming as always. Stay cool. Adios.